Welcome to the e-learning for Sage UBS on the topic of the data migration. Sage UBS has thousands of users in the market and they have been using the product for years. Of course, previous years data is important and it is crucial for businesses to retain this information. There are three options to migrate your data, and this e-learning video will describe all options of how you can do it in Sage UBS 2015. For version 9.2, SR 3.1 and above, please pay attention at method 1. For version 9.2 and below, please take note on method 2A and 2B. If you are currently using version 9.2, SR 3.1 and above, you can migrate data into Sage UBS 2015 using this method. When you start Sage UBS 2015, it will ask, if you would like to migrate data from previous versions. Select Yes. You will notice that instantly, all the data folders found are listed. Notice that, system automatically pairs all your accounting and inventory and billing data folders that are linked. White signifies the data is on the local drive, while a green background tells you that your data is on a network drive or another computer. You may also pair the data folders manually by selecting them from the drop-down list. Select the set of data you want to migrate. You can choose to use the company name from accounting or inventory and billing, or to assign a new company name. Click on the Detail button to verify the folder. Once complete, click Migrate Data to start the migration process. This may take a few moments, depending on the size of the data. When complete, there will be a notice. You may choose to click on the details to verify and view the execution steps. Once you are done, you will be returned to the new landing page of Sage UBS, and there you will find your new migrated company icon. Migration is that simple. If you are currently using version 9.2, or lower versions, you can migrate data into Sage UBS 2015 using this method. Upon login, it will ask, if you would like to migrate data from previous versions. Select Yes. You may ask the system to search all drives or you specify the location of your previous Sage UBS installation manually. Let's try search all drives. System checks for the number of drives and folder available. Click search to begin. Select the correct directories. All the data folders found are listed. This means the inventory and billing data folder is not linked to any accounting data folder previously. System automatically pairs all your accounting and inventory and billing data folders that are linked. You may also pair the data folders manually by selecting them from the drop-down list. Select the set of data you want to migrate. You can choose to use the company name from accounting or inventory and billing or to assign a new company name. Click on the Detail button to verify the data folders. Click Migrate Data to start the migration process. This may take a few moments, depending on the size of the data. When complete, there will be a notice. You may choose to click on the details to verify and view the execution steps. Once you are done, you will be returned to the new landing page of Sage UBS, 
and there you will find your new migrated company icon. That's all you need to do, it's so simple. Just now, we got the system to search all drives. Now let's try the method of specifying the exact location of previous installation. Other than from the login page, you can access the data migration function from the landing page. Click on the migration icon on the top left corner. Select search data folder in this locations option. Browse for the folder path, where the older version for both the systems are installed. Verify that you have selected the correct folders. System automatically pairs all your accounting and inventory and billing data folders that are linked. You may also pair the data folders manually by selecting them from the drop-down list. Select the set of data you want to migrate. You can choose to use the company name from accounting or inventory and billing or to assign a new company name. Click on the detail button to verify the data folders. Click Migrate Data to start the migration process. This may take a few moments, depending on the size of the data. When complete, there will be a notice. You may choose to click on the details to verify and view the execution steps. Once you are done, you will be returned to the new landing page of Sage UBS, and there you will find your new migrated company icon. That's it, it's so easy. After the data migration process is completed, let's see what else has been migrated over, firstly, users. So, you do not need to recreate the user logins again. Secondly, last year data. All last year data saved within the data folder are migrated. Lastly, if you have customized report templates and you saved it in the data folder, the report templates are copied over as well. Sage UBS Data Migration, simple and reliable. Thank you, and have a nice day.